You shot straight, but you shot late. High level. This is the Rundown Podcast. I'm gonna give you the rundown. I'm gonna give you the rundown. Say man, hey man, hey man. It's OG Jacario. Now I'm back at you with another one. And the YouTube streets and social media, Instagram, Facebook, right, Twitter. Everybody's talking about Cassie speaking out. Finally, she's broken her silence. And this is what she had to say on Instagram. Thank you for all the love and support from my family, friends, strangers, and those I have yet to meet. The outpouring of love has created a place for my younger self to settle and feel safe now. But this is only the beginning. DV is the issue. It broke me down to someone I never thought I would become. With a lot of hard work, I am better today, but I will always be recovering from my past. Thank you to everyone that has taken the time to take this matter seriously. My only ask is that everyone open your heart to believe in victims the first time. It takes a lot of heart to tell the truth out of a situation that you were powerless in. I offer my hand to those that are still living in fear. Reach out to your people. Don't cut them off. No one should carry this weight alone. This healing journey is never ending, but this support means everything to me. Thank you. Love always, Cassie. Now, as you see, Cassie never mentioned Diddy's name, and Diddy didn't mention Cassie's name neither, and a lot of people were wondering about that. Why come he never actually said her name in his so-called apology? Well, it's supposed to be some type of agreement, right, that they can't say each other's names. And, you know, I guess that's court ordered or whatever. And, um, that's why Cassie never mentioned Diddy's name in this uh, post that she made on Instagram. Cassie's husband also spoke out when the video surfaced, but he actually reposted something that he had uh, said, you know, earlier when the uh, case was first being filed or whatever. And now we have Cassie finally speaking out and breaking her silence, you guys. And I couldn't imagine that it took a lot for her to even, you know, break her silence on this whole ordeal because a lot of people have been ridiculing Cassie, you know, and uh, a lot of people have supported her, more supporters than the ridicule from what I see. And, you know, a lot of women are rallying around her and there's a lot of women out there that are going through the same issue right now to this day at this very moment that Cassie went through back in 2016 all the way up until 2019 where it was uh, said that her and Diddy broke it off or whatnot. And you know, to anybody out there that's going through anything similar or worse than Cassie was going through, you know, you should definitely reach out to the authorities and you know, try to get some help and try to get that person that's actually uh, doing these horrible and deplorable abusive things to you, you know, arrested and criminally charged. You know, a lot of people had questions why Cassie never went after Diddy criminally and tried to get him charged and put in jail, right? For those things he was doing to her, abusing her all those years, right? And people tried to say that Cassie was putting her hands on him and he was putting his hands on her, right? But at the end of the day, we only seen what uh, Diddy did to her and no man should be, you know, doing anything like that to a woman, right? So whether or not Cassie went after Diddy, you know, criminally and got charges filed against him, she still, you know, got her just due and she hit him in his bank account pretty hefty, right? And some say it was a $30 million uh, lawsuit that was settled on. And, you know, as we all seen, Diddy, you know, instantly, the next day, settled on that money. And amicably, as they said, you know, she was paid off. So y'all let me know what y'all think about this whole ordeal in the comment section. And until next time, this is OG Jacario TV. You're watching the Rundown Podcast. I appreciate everybody for spending with me. I appreciate all my subscribers for sliding with your boy every time. And say, man, hey, man, hey, man. Keep hitting that like button. Keep hitting that subscribe button. And look, turn on post notification so we can slide whenever I get the drop. And you already know what it is, man. It's deeper than booty hair. And guess what? I'm gone.